Senator B is the favorite candidate in the North and he will win in Plateau State, Benue State, Patrick Daku. And in using four. Ahead of the 2023 presidential election, the Labour Party LP Gubantara candidate in Plateau State, Patrick Daku, has opined that the former Anabra State Governor and the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter B, is the most favorite presidential candidate in the northern geopolitical zone. He predicted that Peter B would also emerge winner in Plateau State, Benue State, and a larger shock of the Niger State. He opined that, contrary to the popular belief that Peter B is only popular in the SATA geopolitical zone, mostly especially in the Southeast geopolitical zone, he said that Peter B movement is more than just his candidacy and he's also equally gaining momentum and ground in the Northern geopolitical zone. He noted that the Labour Party LP presidential candidate would win close to 80% of the votes in Plateau State, a state which is also a part of the Northern geopolitical zone. He said he has visited Nasarawa State and he has been expressed by the asset acceptability of the Peter B's candidacy in the region. He noted that Reality Checks has reviewed that former governor of Anambra State, Peter B, would definitely emerge victorious in some northern states, especially in the north central, and he would also give a good run to whoever emerge winner in the northeast and northwest to political zone. He said the ruling party the All Progressive Congress, APC, has never won in federal capital territory, but he is rest assured that Peter B would emerge winner in the Abuja state and also in Kwara state. On this mountain, can you state a lot of accept acceptability is also coming up if you ask me? Is Peter B the most favorite? If you ask me, is Peter B is the most favorite candidate in not? The answer might not be yes. But if you say that OB comes in first or second in some state in the north, I will say yes. Reality check review that in the northeast OB might not come first, but in the northwest OB Peter B will give a good run to whoever comes in as number one there. In the north central, he has the highest chance of coming first because Obi will win in Plateau, Benue, and Shop of Niger. I want you to note that the APC has never won in the Federal Capital Territory, Abuja. I can assure you that FP will win the FCT hands down. Kwara State is also another big opportunity for Peter B. All we need. To do is continue with the momentum, momentum, and, uh, and ensure that the energies are converted into votes. We believe everything will just go well for this country. Yes, sir. Therefore, my listeners are the workers will be taken on the short time. Even as Peter B is the favorite candidate in the north, and he will win in Plateau and Benue, Patrick Dacum. Please react to that. If you do so, we believe we'll do justice to every of your reactions. We thank God that the various opinion that already popped in from the comment section. The first one is from the person of Easy. He said, Thank you, sir, for your understanding of the APC Nigeria. He said, Their use of religion and not propaganda to deceive poor Nigerians and religious bigot to engage themselves in. An unnecessary fight against one another, but God Almighty has answered the prayers of Nigeria youth that this time we must get it right and flush away the Kabas who has sworn to pull this country down. By all means, Bola and Atiku will never see us again. That's where they go. Then from Ayede, say Peter B winning in North. I'm sorry for you. So, so you know, say. They like and for, for the other part before. Now, one for you, that news to you. Now, one for you. Then from Bama, he said, I pray that he is going to win in Adamawa and most other northern states. 
In short, I perceive little or no opposition. It will carry go. Now say they go. Then from Adeba, you say this is the most stupid comment. You say this one any, any more progress. <laughs> any more progress. You not know, like, you know, like will be you not know, like Nigeria, you not know, like any good thing. And now what for you? Then from Kingsley, say Peter B is the best candidate among them. Now say they go. It's not good to sell himself. Then from Art Vasho. He said the Emmy Loaku saw this. They you just want to pretend. They did not they don't they did not to give themselves false hope we will save Nigeria this time. I said they go. Then from somewhere, he said these LP guys are dreamers. <laughs> they are not dreamers in a reality. This is not this thing. You to say if you, you want no more support better thing, so people want no better thing, no go support them. Thank God, majority of people they support Peter B. So that is why majority win the vote. So you know what you want to do. Then from Joshua, say somewhere. Okay, Joshua somewhere. Say he also you see, say he also win in Sabisa Forest. <laughs> this one now, these people say, but they for the start they say, yeah, they put it for this country. If you did this country, this country they would they sink. Then you still want to uh, make maybe probably APC continue or make a uh, to become president. Now what for now? Hmm. You get conscience. So. Then from Prince. He said, God Almighty is certainly on the throne. Let his perfect We be done. I said, they go. Then from Oyeka, he said, forget Southeast. South we, he said, South, we are in control. Nigeria are tired of APC mismanagement and we will try to complain. Tinibu will tell us to shut up our mouth. You're not going to be doing anything again. Then from Gessy Sword, I said, they go. Then from Adi. Deja Demola, I say best of luck to you, but when it is time, everyone will see. And I say they go. I think all this time we are wrapping it. Please endeavor to subscribe to this channel and also ensure that you share this very news to stream that platform. If you do so, believe the Almighty God will do the very need for your life. Bye bye.